Hi guys, Cranky Kaz here. And the Shapester. And we're back with more Yakuza 3. In the last episode, I managed to uh, defeat Tetsuo Tamashiro. And he was a bit of a son of a bitch. He was really hard. Uh, but we got there, used all my items, and now I think we're going to go straight into a cutscene for Chapter 4. Is it Chapter 4? I think so. A new chapter. It is Chapter 4. The Man in the Sketch. Ooh. So this is about... Kazuma, or Kazuma's look-alike. Yes, a year later. Hi, Kiryu. What is that? Kashiwagi. Kashiwagi, sorry. I'm just a doctor. あとで駆け直してもいいですか。キリュ。6代目が撃たれた。ダーゴ、ウィノウォルトホスピタル。ダイゴ。ああ、ない。え、what?。So <笑> The splitting image. <laughs> or the spitting image, even. Yes. Why are we playing ignorant to this? Or has someone else been shot as well? Or someone else been got? We did say we didn't see Saki in the room with Daigo, so it's quite possible that someone else is being shot, like you said. Yeah. So, yes, someone else as well. Hang on, yeah, wait. I can't pause it. The old guy. Right. So he's been shot and Daigo's been shot, I think. By Kazuma, by the looks of it. Daigo Uttano. Sono Eno. Otokonandeska. So Rashinda. So there's been a double hit job on the two people that were involved in discussions about the military plan and mm. the resort. So that's why they're there and we're in Okinawa. Yeah. Which makes more sense. Why would you be in Okinawa with Daigo? Like, yeah. in the hospital. Mm -hmm. Right. How's the boss? We've done all we can to stabilise his condition. Is he going to make it? Hard to say with absolute certainty. He was shot three times at point-blank range after all. Ouch. <laughs> all the bullets appear to have narrowly missed his vital organs. Okay. Thank God for that. 50-50 odds. So if he dies, we... Uh, oh, well, we think Kazuma's done it, yeah, because Saki's mm -hmm. drawn the picture. <sighs> he managed to call an ambulance entirely on his own, despite having been shot multiple times. Don't think he's ready to leave you all just yet. He's got fighting spirit. He has. Still can't get over how sweet Haruka is. She's mm. just so cute. <laughs> Uncle Kaz? Nanda. <laughs> Nanda. Are, <laughs> are you going to go back to Kamurocho? Oh, I hope we are. Oh, I don't know if I am. I have a life here now. I don't have time to go running off to Tokyo at the drop of a hat. Yeah, we do. If you don't, we're going to lose the orphanage, right? Hard to say. One thing's for sure, whoever shot Nakahara was after the deed for our land. Aniki! Stop calling me Aniki, Aniki! <laughs> I've got a favour to ask. I want to go to Kamurocho with you. I know you're going to try and get the deed back, which means finding the guy who shot the boss. He wants revenge. Or, well, 
<laughs> I haven't decided I'm going. <laughs> oh, and Mikio can stick around the hospital while we're gone. He's on board if it means get us getting payback for what that asshole did to the boss. And Saki, what happens to her? <laughs> uh. Uh, <laughs> look, I'm glad you want revenge for your boss, but who's going to be there to look after Saki if you're not around? Also, you'll kind of slow me down, dude. <laughs> I could do it. Oh, Haruka. <laughs> <laughs> Saki-chan can stay with us at the orphanage. It's not going to be easy, you know. I know, but she's probably been really lonely with her dad in the hospital and everything. Maybe it'd be good for her to spend some time with kid other kids for once. I'm sure the others would love to have a new friend to play with too. But I'm trying to get out of taking Rookie here. <laughs> <laughs> you might be. <laughs> this time I need you to trust me. We'll take good care of her. Haruka. I guess it means you're going to be leaving the orphanage in Haruka's hands, basically. And she's still at school herself. Oh, you totally will get in my way, but fine. <laughs> It's like, ugh, fine. <laughs> as long as we can do some cool combos in fights, I'll be okay with that. Yeah. <sighs> in our kitschy shirts, we'll uh, <laughs> both go to Kamurocho. I have to say I am missing Kamurocho a little bit. He's leaving now. あいつはここに置いていく。今のカムロチョは危険すぎる。あいつを連れて行くわけにはいかない。おじさん。He's a sneaky one, Kiryu, isn't he? Mm. I actually think I'm going to stay out here a little longer. Let's do some fishing. Really? Let's fish in the starlight. Yeah, in, in, under the night sky. Also, there's another box. I want to see if there's a... Pro there was a box. There was a box in the cutscene, wasn't there? I'm not imagining that. I didn't <gasps> see. There's a shiny. I That'd see you fish. there. I see you, shiny. Oh, a locker. Mm. A lock key, sorry. Seems like a good time to go and do some fishing before we head I'd to the camera. Says, maybe not now. A fishing pole. Ah. A little fishing might be fun. We may not get a chance for a while, so let's give it a try. Select your bait, then decide where to cast your line. Each type of bait has a different range of effect, and the fish won't bite if you use the wrong bait. Uh, cast your line and wait for a fish to bite. Quickly press X to reel the line in. Okay, R1, L1 to reel in and add slack. There's a tension gauge. Oh God. Don't let the fish snap the line. Tilt the left stick left and right following the movement. Tilt it up and down to raise or lower. Got it. Not very good at these fishing games. So why are you doing it? <laughs> I just want to try it out. Fair enough. Why not? Yeah. Even if we never do it again. Two worms, a lobster, and, and some dog, dog food. food. <gasps> Let's use a worm. Okay. A reminder of the controls. So. Uh, nice. He was it. Um. So I press X quickly when one bites. Press, press, press. Hooked. Hooked. Uh, oh god. Oh god. Reel it in, reel it in, reel it in. Oh yeah, yeah. In. And, and follow the. Yeah, yeah. Got it. Oh sh. Ah. So yeah, I gotta keep the tension. Let's try that again, shall we? <laughs> I love how dramatic they make the mini games. I know. Just remembering, like, what was it? You could. I lost uh... my worm. Right, yeah. we'll, we'll have one more try with with the worm. Was it in Yakuza Zero? I saw you do it, or Yakuza Kiwami? I don't know. Where you basically it was like I was a dating over the phone, blind dating. Oh yeah. And it, it was always very dramatic. I picked up the phone like. Hurrah! <laughs> yeah. Hello. <laughs> yeah, I remember. <laughs> uh, 
Come on then. Come on. Here, yeah, fishy, fishy. Nothing. Right, come on. We can do this. What? What? What am I doing wrong? Are you reeling in? Yeah, I'm pressing the X, but then the tension's just going right down. How do I stop? Do you want to have a go? See if you can catch something. I'll and if have not, a go. we'll just not that I have. Uh... Use use um, the lobster. You need to use the lobster. Yeah, why not? Okay. Wow. And if you can't do it, then we'll just carry on. And you guys in the comments can let us know what we're doing wrong. Use it. It's the tension was going down, but I don't know what I needed to do differently there. Something. I mean, I wasn't lifting the pole up and down, so maybe... Are you holding it then? I'm using the shoulder buttons. It didn't tell you... Oh, the shoulder buttons for the tension. The reeling in. I wasn't reeling it in. Ugh. Okay. You need to be pressing X to get it closer, though. Really? Yeah. It's getting further out. No, it's not. It's getting closer. Where were you, tension? I know. Right, so I was pressing X, which is one half of what you need to do. Shobes was doing the shoulders, which is the... Ah! I know. It's got further out again. Ooh. Now I know about... Now I've remembered about the L1 and R1. I think I get it. It's got further away, hasn't it? It has, I don't know. Because you're not pressing X. You need to reel in with X. So like reel in I'm a bit. I'm pressing X and it's doing nothing. Yeah, you've got to keep pressing X to reel it in. I'm pressing X, it's doing nothing. Yeah, it is doing stuff. Why is it getting further away? So give yourself some slack. That's what I'm doing. You've got your rod like really high. So when the tension's low, reel it in now. <laughs> Let's have a look at the controls again, shall we? Confirm, pull rods. Reel in with R1. That's what I'm doing. And it's not, bring it in. Unless it's just a really difficult fish. But I thought you needed to keep pressing X. I think it said X to start it off, but yeah, if I press X, it's doing nothing. Is this fish just like a monster fish or something? That'd be about right. Can you tire it? the fish out by using the left analog to sort of? If, if you follow the direction the fish is going in. God, the Japanese yeah. love their fishing games, don't they? That's that is doing, working, that's it, yes. That's doing it. Yeah, okay. So you've got to tie the fish out, basically. That's how you do it. You go in the same direction. Yeah, and, bring and, it in and don't let your reel get too tight. Right, so we're, we're getting there, yeah. So you don't need to use the exit at all? No. You do it to start it off. Right. It's getting closer. It's a We're direction. getting there. This better be a... This fish better be worth it. All this for one fish. It looks like a freaking whale. It looks massive. We did put a lobster on. Mm. That's huge! Congratulations! Yeah. <laughs> After we work out of it. A 36 centimetre Mibai. I can oh. now one for grouper. A fish with okay. a light, delicious flavour. Stop fishing. <laughs> I don't think we want to fish anymore. <laughs> An hour later, still fishing. Yeah, that's enough for now. I see where you got the whole pressing X to bring it in thing. 
Yeah. Um, but I think that basically kicks it off, and then you have to use the shoulder buttons, as we found there. And then, yeah. as it turned out, going in the direction of it swimming. Tie the, the fish out, it. and then just, yeah. Well, if you're reeling it in, and but going in the same way, it's sort of, you're bringing it closer, yeah. but it's not going to snap your thing. Yeah. So. I just completely forgot about the shoulder buttons. There's a shard of tempered glass in the box. Excellent. Is that a weapon? Because it's certainly not a bit of bait, is it? I'm not sure. Anyway, let's keep on uh, moving. So your goal is in the orphanage, by the looks of it. Yep. Hello, Haruka. What's wrong? Can't sleep? I guess there's a lot on my mind, but you don't need to wait for me, Uncle Kaz. You have a big trip tomorrow. True, we should probably hit the hate. We're off. There's a dog? Do they always have a dog? I, I don't remember. That's not the dog from Camarocho, is it? Oh, is it Haruka's dog that we rescued? I don't know. I don't know. Oi. No, I don't think it is. You, she's reacting to it as though... You're going to get it this time, you stupid mutt. Stop! Oh, it's a Zumi, that is. Sorry. Not Haruka. This dog a friend of yours? Izumi looks tiny compared to Haruka. Yeah, I don't know. I just saw. I just assumed it was Haruka walking up next to her. Okay. Oh shit! I know where that dog's from. <laughs> Language, Mikio. <laughs> oh, it's not that woman's dog. The one we rescued. I. Mm -hmm. He used to live over at an. Izakaya in Hatsumachi. Quiet little fella back then, not the maniac he is now. Honestly, he saw out of his mind. I didn't even recognise him at first, but he's definitely the same dog. The guy who ran that place shipped on up to Tokyo a while ago, though. Guess he just abandoned the dog. Can I go look for the dog? Just wait. I'm sure he'll come back. Alright, you want? we're looking for a dog now. Yep. It's taking a while to get going, this, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. He got away. You're just slow, Tai Chi. I, I could totally have caught him. Oh, yeah, then why didn't you? Right, where'd he go? Towards town. I thought we were leaving last night. <sighs> and we've just gone to bed. I... Uh... We totally said we were leaving in the night, I thought. Mm-hmm. How about me and Izumi go take a peek over on Ryukyu Boulevard? You can check out Hatsumachi. Sounds hmm. good. Sounds good, yes. Well, yeah. they're red Sounds light good. district, basically. Maybe an introduction to hostess clubs is on the cards? I told you, we don't want any ice cream. Uncle Kaz is going to say the same thing. Yeah. Damn it, kid. You're not listening to the words coming out of my mouth. I need to see a guy named Kazuma Kiryu. What's going on here? Nanda? Nanda. Wait, are you Kazuma Kiryu? Yeah. What do you want with one of my kids? I don't appreciate people pressuring them to buy ice cream. No, I don't either. <laughs> or lollies. Those little lolly sticks. Anyway. Off topic. I have come for you. I know you know Kamiyama. Oh, he's going to teach me how to use weapons. I trained Kamiyama in the use of a bunch of weapons he carries. I'm kind of a master at them. Um, he told me all about how you were looking for new and exciting ways to bust skulls. So here I am. Why would a master come all this way at the request of his pupil? Also, one of his kids is right there. <laughs> yeah, that's very true. Okay, okay, you're a little suspicious, understandable, but I'm not a rich dude. I spend most of my time selling ice cream on the beach. Um, Kamiyama is my pupil, but he also sells me weapons at a discount because I'm such a great guy. And because I'm such a great guy, I can't refuse him when he asks me to do something. Yeah, fair enough. Let's learn. 
As long as I don't yes. have to pass some sort of training. I'm, I'm going to have to pass training, aren't I? Yeah, probably. Come find me on the beach if you're man enough, that is. Oh, right. Where are you? Oh, there he is. Oh, what's that? Oh. I wanted to look at the thing. Oh, never mind. Well, if it ain't my star ass kicker, ready to hone your ass kicking skills? <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. So there's one itty bitty thing I need to know first. What kind of weapons can you already use? I don't actually know. I can use an umbrella. And a staff. Okay, it's the sword and staff. Everything else is self-taught. To get information about the weapons you can currently use, press triangle on the pause menus upgrade screen. Display abilities and look under weapons. All right then. Yes, nunchucks. I was wow. hoping it'd be nunchucks. Perfect. Take off your shirt and get in the ring. That's what I'd say to him as well. No way you're going to be able to move the way you need to dress like that. <laughs> you just sighing at me in the background. Just rolling my eyes. Just like, yeah, yeah, whatever. <laughs> How was that? Yeah, perfect. So when do I get my nunchucks? Never. Okay, we've got to beat him for them. You can't truly master a weapon until you beat an armed opponent unarmed. <gasps> so you've got to beat him without the weapon first. With my fists and then, oh god. Do that and you'll be forced to learn the weapon's weak points. This is how you learn. Okay. So I've got to beat, beat him <laughs> while he's using nunchucks. Oh, yeah. To be fair, my fists were more powerful than the weapons I was using. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Get up, dude. I <laughs> love how you can do that. Pick him up. You're taking too long. Get up. Yep. <laughs> Ow! Ah! Good job. Right, dude. That was a bit harsh. He's looking a bit worse for wear. He now. is. Damn, Kiryu-san, you done did it. Now you're a master of the nunchucku. Nunchucku. <laughs> Nunchucks. Your training is done, Chuck. <laughs> Come on, Kiryu-san. The pun wasn't that bad. Yeah, it was. kind of was. No, it's not that. Listen, Yoshinar uh, Yonashiro, not Yoshinaro. Are you really a strong fighter? What? You injure me, sir. How could you look upon my sick fighting skills and not despair? No, that's why I'm asking. To tell you the truth, I didn't have much trouble beating you. So which is it? Are you holding back or are you really that weak? Money. Not a single one of the chumps Kamiyama referred to me ever figured that out. Not one. But you, you did. I should have known you would. Okay. You know what? Let's do this. Oh god, is this the real fight then? Okay. It's Hyper Yonashiro Hyper time. Hyper Yonashiro time. All you did was take off your hat. <laughs> this cap is literally a cap. You feel me? A cap. On my abilities. When I'm wearing it, my power is capped. <laughs> when it's off, I'm fully uncapped. I love Yakuza. Um, are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> Never better, why do you ask? Same rules as before, drop me and don't get dropped. And you forget that guy you just fought, this is hard mode, you're on a shiro. <sighs> okay. <laughs> just when you think this couldn't get weirder, right. Ah, oh, balls. Ah! Ah! Yeah, he's doing more damage now. Fine, 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 fine. <laughs> ah! Ooh! Ooh! 
Oh, she oh killed. feisty! Ooh, I can't quick step out the way in time! Ooh. When you grab him. Whoa! Oh. Ah. We grab him from behind, surely. Come on, Kiryu. Get him! Get him! Oh. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay, so he gets out of that. That's a bit annoying. Oh, wow. Whoa, okay. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, what? Yeah. Oh, okay, all right. It's blocking, basically, whenever yeah. you try and do stuff from the front. Oh, shit. Oh, balls, oh, balls. Get it, he could have got him then. Shit, 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 kill you! Shit! Don't need to use my health! Woo! God, you made that look like fucking hard work. Do you want to try? <laughs> <laughs> you, my man, are full of shit and vinegar. <laughs> I've never heard that before. I was serious that time, man. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> he definitely stepped up. I was wondering if it was going to be a real step up, yeah. or whether he was saying it was going to be a step on. He was the same as before. You're definitely the real thing, Yonashiro san. Can you teach me another weapon later? <laughs> Careful, you might just stop my heart saying stuff like that, or hitting me the way you do. Either one, really. That's why I like you. A fancy certificate. A wow. Certificate. Show this to Kamiyama. That little piggy will crap his pants. Even better, he'll sell you some nunchucks. Ah, so you have to master them before you can even use, use them. them at all. Which I suppose makes sense. That is the same in another one of the Yakuza games I've played. I now can't remember which one. Might be Yakuza 0. Because you could get weapons for Majima, but you couldn't use them as Kiryu unless you'd learned them. I might be forgetting. It might have been Kiwami. Can't remember. Okay. Um... I hear he can even make you a custom pair if you got the designs and materials. Ask him for the details. I only know about beating fools with them, not making them. <laughs> oh. Right, okay. So I'm guessing you can come back here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, uh. <laughs> yeah, your health is actually low. <laughs> and I you need mm. some more food. Can you eat that fish? This shard of glass is actually bulletproof. Too small to block bullets now. Okay. I have I have no thing that I can use. No thing? Nothing. Does um, he actually limp around as well? Wow. I mean, I'm dying here. Maybe I can go rest before we do whatever I do next. But I really need to get some... Uh, Stamina and X's in me, or whatever they're called. I wonder if it's going to be one of those things where it just leave you back at your original health once you were done, but apparently not. No, apparently not. I wonder if you, you'd have got a game over if you'd have uh, lost that. It looks like I might have done. Yeah, let us know in the comments if you can die. Um, well, I'm going to go and rest. Um, oh, can I? I don't think I can actually do anything. Let's just save in case I end up in a really shitty situation. I was kind of hoping that would heal me. <laughs> Sorry, Kiryu. Like, um, oh, this woman's playing Yakuza again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking a pounding as a result. You shut your face, you <laughs> cheeky. Can you go up that alleyway? This one? Yes. No. Ah. It looked on the map like you could. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm still... Oh! There. My map's slightly better now. Right, I don't want to get into a fight until I've actually bought some stuff. Where's the nearest shop? I don't know. 
Let's try and find it. That's not helpful. List. There we go. I could go get some food. Umachi dinner. Diner. Dinner. <laughs> <laughs> I'm near. I'm near a diner. Let's let's see if I can. What's this one? A shut door. A shut door. Where's this diner? Oh here. Oh, I think this is one I tried to go into before, isn't mm -hmm. it? What would I like to drink? Uh, full bodied flavour, please. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I'm going to get hungry now. I always do. Pig's ears. No, no thanks. Seaweed. Ooh. Pig's feet. <laughs> Tofu. Tofu just doesn't taste of anything. Pork belly. That sounds quite nice. Fish, fish. Let's have the pork. That's better. Yeah. And experience points to go with it. Look at that. Ugh. <laughs> Okay, so we've at least healed if we bump into anyone. Yep, that's good. So, Hatsumachi. Hatsumachi, but there's uh, some side things now appearing, so maybe we should do some of that. Mm hmm. Did I hear you say something about English classes? Oh, oh yes! yes. <laughs> if you register now, you're entitled to a free handbook that will teach you all the ins and outs of the language. Hmm. Not so sure. Why don't you try reading this book first, then you'll be speaking natural English in no time. Okay. Do you, see you <laughs> need some help? <laughs> English is the kind of language where you can say one thing a lot of different ways, so it can be a little intimidating at first. Each phrase has been academically peer-reviewed for optimal accuracy. Have, Have a, a nice, nice day. day. Why do I get the feeling that? You can say that in two ways as well. And you, one way where you mean it and one way you don't. Um, okay, well that was random. So that's going to pop up again. I bet that textbook that she's given you is a load of crap. There's a shiny up there. There is. And there's a taxi. Another locker key. Uh. You really need a taxi to go where you're going? No, I don't think so. I'm just, uh, I'm just gonna have an explore because we haven't really been round. Can I go this way? Apparently oh, not. Apparently not. How do I get to that question mark then? Hmm. Uh, go around. Yeah, maybe. Okay. So up here and then round, I guess. Mhm. Mm yeah, it's our first time actually getting a chance to explore a bit more. Um. And also the boss fight, Tetsuo, Tetsuo? Tamashiro. Tamashiro was quite difficult. So I feel like it's worth doing a bit of side stuff mm. as we go along. Hey, what's wrong? You look like a vein's about to pop. Cabaret club. <sighs> well, I, uh, I probably shouldn't be bothering a random stranger with this, but business hasn't been so good lately. I'll help you. I'm the manager here and uh, it's a long story. Would, I, would you mind if I asked you for some advice? Sure, why not? Thank you. I'd hate to make you stand in the streets. So let's talk inside. Yee. I'm so excited. Actually, there's a girl named Natsumi who works at the club. She's the number one hostess on the roster. She's pretty. She brings in the crowd. She's even got wealthy members of the elite wrapped around her finger. It's unbelievable. Oh, that's a good thing, right? Not exactly. She started using her status as leverage to influence the club's business decisions. On top of that, she's developed a terrible attitude at work and it seems she wants me fired from the club. Okay, not so good then. Hmm. Why don't you fire her first? Can't do that. She's responsible for so much of our revenue. Losing her would completely be the end of us. Sassy as she is. Hmm. Oh, well, if it isn't our hardworking manager, just what are you plotting over here? Speak of the devil. 
Um, hmm, haven't seen you around here before. Well, doesn't matter. I'm off to Hawaii as it is. Hold down the fort for me, okay? Hey, you can't just up and abandon us. This is your job. Not to burst your bubble, but my ride's almost here. Catch you later. Daddy-o. Daddy-o. <laughs> okay, so we're going to have to start from scratch, basically. Had the best idea. Why don't you work at our club for a while? What, as a host? Okay, no, as ah, a coach. Ah, so basically that's setting up the story, and ultimately this would be a big side quest where you make the place successful, and she comes Without back, her, and you'll be like, we don't need come you. Back, yeah. <laughs> When can you start? Let's do it. Oh, go yeah. on then. I don't know if I'll be of much help, but I suppose I could give it a shot. What about the orphanage? Meh. And the fact details, that we're details. meant to be going to Camarocho. Yep. And we're looking for a dog at the moment. That's the whole reason we're here. <laughs> oh, are we? Yeah. <laughs> I forgot about that. Kiri-san, I'd like you to recruit a new hostess right away. Wait, I'm not going to be coaching the hostess that's already working for you. All of our girls have fallen under Natsumi's spell, so there won't be much you can do. So we've got to go out and find someone. So you are starting from scratch. Yeah. So we've got some funds. Operating funds. I've got 100,000 yen. Yeah, yen. Yen. <laughs> uh, let's hop right to it. I'll have one of our staff members bring you up to speed. How about Koji? He'll know what to do. Hello, I'm Koji. One of the staff members here. Okay, let's recruit. All you need to do is look for charming girls in downtown Ryukyu and approach them. If you see someone who's a good fit, please bring her over to the club. We only have room for one extra staff member. So please make sure you bring someone who genuinely interests you. Okay. So there might be multiple options and we have to pick the most appropriate lady. Okay. Okay. So it had funds as a uh, separate. Oh shit! There's thing. a guy at the bridge. Oh yeah, no. Oh no! You. No, don't don't do it, Bye. dude. No. What do you think you're doing? Don't try to stop me. I've got no other choice. Stop him. <laughs> Leave him be. <laughs> Lovely. Stop All right, him. see you. Stop him. Whatever your reason, it's not worth it. Now tell me, what's the matter? Truth be told, I'm drowning in debt. It's always a blooming loan shark, isn't it? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Literally, I just finished signing up for a life insurance plan. Ugh, lovely. You know that won't work, right? Life insurance company, very, very practical. <laughs> within, a, within a year of the policy start date, yes. So I'm as worthless dead as I am alive? Pretty much. <laughs> it's an interesting way to stop somebody from uh, going through with it. Well, now what? If I had any money, I wouldn't have taken out those loans in the first place. If I don't pay them off, the loan sharks will kill me anyway. Anyway. What about filing for bankruptcy? Uh... Yeah, because then you can basically clear yourself, can't you? Mm. If you can't pay your debt, it's time to quit. What about filing for bankruptcy? <laughs> if I die, I'm dead. Well, yes. I love how Kiryu is like, he's got a hat for everything. Yeah, he's like, an expert he, he's in everything, He's an expert isn't he? in everything. How do you know so much about all this? I used to work in a similar line of business. So hmm. you won't remember this, but when Kiryu was young in Yakuza 0, he used to do collections for loan sharks. Lucky me, I'm Kishimoto. Pleasure to meet you. Kiryu. Ah, oh, good. Perfect. We have one health item. And 2,000 experience points for doing that. Good. Look, there's even little pigeons that fly away. Yes. Wow. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm easily uh, pleased. Okay, there's some more things around here. Um... What could I have examined just there? Hmm. Guess we'll never know. I figure it's worth doing all these side quests while we can. You might as well. None of them seem to be particularly lengthy so exactly. far. Exactly. Have a conversation with someone. Done. I rate thug. Whoa, hold it, hold it. You <laughs> might let, let me, me knock, knock you around, around a bit. bit. 
everyone, Let everyone runs, runs off. over. Nice. Now who's this guy? I don't know, but let's hit him too. Where's that other guy gone? Kiryu. Kiryu is so slow to... Um... <laughs> Throw him on the ground. I wonder if I can get my attack speed up, whether that'll just help with the dodging and blocking. Because mm. I seem to be really like too slow to block things at the moment. Mm -hmm. Stop, man, stop. You're going to kill me. Take this, you're damn scary. Okay. Good. Excellent. Good. Random fire. So, hello. These guys. How about me and Izumi go take a peek over in uh, Ryuku Boulevard? Why don't you look around Hatsumachi? Which is I, what we're I, planning I to do anyway. But we're doing other things. So, yeah. there's loads of side quests down that way. Right. So, let's go. Ooh, shiny in the middle of the road. Another locker key just there. Your map zoomed My in map again. zoomed in. It's because That's if you better. press L3, it, uh, it speeds it up. up mm. Speeds it up. That's not what I mean. What do I mean? Zooms it in. That's what I mean. Right, where's this person I need to speak? Is it a group of these school kids? There you go. Excuse me, sir. You should really stay away from those lockers. Why is that? People say locker 44 over there is cursed. There was a shiny... Yep. A cursed locker, <laughs> huh? Spooky. Spooky. There was a side quest in... I think it was Kiwami 2, actually. Uh, you never saw it. I think I didn't do it on camera. Mm-hmm. Um, is it here? Or... Up here? Where's these lockers? There's lockers up there. There are about? lockers up there. Where? What's that lady doing? But yeah, there's like loads of lockers up there in the corner. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so there's a side quest in Kiwami 2 that was basically a bit like the... Is it the ring? Mm-hmm. Choose which locker. Super resin. Okay, good. A Royal Joker card. Might as well collect these while we can. Super resilient resin. Sensing a theme here. What are these for? An it's your gem. An azure gem. Great. And that's all of the ones you can do. What is this azure gem? I want to know. Looks like an average blue marble to me. I can't use it. This stuff has a lot of bounce. I can't use that. I don't know what these things are. We talk to that lady who's uh, looking concerned. A keyless woman. She's lost her key. Nope, but I guess we're going to go find it. I live on the third floor here, and I know I had it when I left my place. Uh, so we have to go into first person mode to find the key that's being dropped somewhere. Okay. Are you? For, is this for real? Apparently. Oh, sorry, dude. Did I drop it around here? Uh, so you can't move in first person mode by the looks I of it. I can't move, so I just have to... What, like stand and then guess? This is going to take me forever. Maybe if I stand near her then. So there's potentially a window she dropped out of as well. I don't know which window. Yeah. What happens if you look up? Can you see the window that she's referring to? Uh, uh, ah! There it is. Hey, what's that? That might be the key the woman was talking about. Hey, you were looking for your key. Yes, did you find it? Maybe? There's something up on the edge of that hallway on the third floor. Well, you said it, lady. <laughs> hmm. Huh. Huh. Another lock key. Oh, while you're here. Mm-hmm. 
Okay. I bet it would come in handy for you, though. Let me guess. It's a weapon, and you think that we're... That sounds <laughs> vaguely illegal. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go see if that is a weapon. Oh, there's something at the top of there. Ah, first person mode. Yeah. A, a hyper, hyper stun, stun gun. gun. Yep. That okay. sounds amazing. Right. Right. So uh, out of here and first person mode. Back. Oh, stand I back can't a bit. Appear. If you're too close, yeah. then there you go. Examine. What's this? Number thirty-eight. Someone's just left it on the top. Okay. Another super More resilient resin. Resin, and resin. we don't know what that does yet. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's a start. I wonder if you're going to have a selection of lockers in back in Camarocho again as well. Did we work out what the C was? The what? What the C was on the map. No. Right. If anyone can tell us what the C actually sort of stands for. I thought it was checkpoint at one point, but it doesn't seem to be. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's a taxi, so it's this person over here. Yep. A lovelorn teenager. What should I do? What should I say? I've got to talk to her somehow. Hey, could you move? You're kind of blocking the restaurant. I need your help. Tell me how to be a man. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> I know it's a weird thing to ask. Yeah, it is a weird thing to ask a stranger. I need to talk to someone about this. Okay, we'll hear, I'll hear you, out. you out. Yeah. So there's this girl who works at the burger joint. The moment I saw her, it was love at first sight. I don't know the right way to tell her how I feel. If we've got options to pick from, I'm going to pick the wrong one. <laughs> well, deliberately or just... No, just <laughs> because I, I don't know how to do these things. What would you do if you were in my shoes? Would you just straight up tell her how you feel, or... Just give up? <laughs> well, not that one, then. Uh... <sighs> See, I'm hopeless at, like, writing stuff, so I'd probably just say talk to her. But then suck it up and talk to her just sounds like the wrong thing. It's just in the sense of, like, look, just do it. Should we say that? That's probably what I'd do if I was Kiryu. Alright, we'll say that then. It's the wrong thing, but we'll tell him to know. do that. Go for a kid. Comes out of a black eye. What'd she say? The only thing oh. I could say was my order. Now I've got an empty heart and a full stomach. I tried, but I couldn't get myself to talk to her. What am I going to do now? <sighs> write her a letter. Just write her a letter. <laughs> He's even done that already. Okay. Why do I get the feeling this isn't going to work either? Well, he certainly came prepared. Did you give nope. it to her? <laughs> I bought a burger instead. <laughs> kind of want a burger. And some of those cheesy jalapeno things from Burger King. <laughs> Anyone else like those? I love them. What happened to the letter? Couldn't find the courage to give it to her. I'm so pathetic. What am I going to do now? This is worse than I thought. In that case, how about... Send her a text. <laughs> Have you got a number? Don't just give up. No. <laughs> I mean, if you can't even write a letter. Send her a text. Not a big fan of doing Do stuff like that number? over text. But if you can't tell her in person, that might be your best bet. Yeah, exactly. How would you? I don't have a number. Uh... Ask her out. Oh, okay. You're going to go with that option then. Okay. That ain't going to work because he ain't going to come along and do it. I've got the yeah. sinking feeling his invitation isn't going to make it past his lips. I got a shape with my burger. <laughs> How many burgers does that make now? Well, she was talking to one of the other workers about oh, how right. she hates going to the movies. It just wasn't the right time to ask her to see a movie. Just ask her out. Yeah. Damn it, man. Why do I feel like giving up on her is going to be the answer? Hmm. Straighten it out for you. Wow. Straighten out that spine of yours or I'll straighten it out for you. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> 
This doesn't work. He's sore out of luck. <clears throat> the best I can manage right now is ordering burgers. I don't understand how you can even eat that much. I'll go tell her how you feel. I'll fear. go. <laughs> Wait, what? Look, you're not getting anywhere with this. I'll talk to her for He's you. Just, like, just follow me in. Just pipe, pipe down. down. Is this the girl? And that's how it is. Can I get a hamburger? <laughs> no, you're actually doing that. <laughs> The only reason this guy's been buying boatloads of burgers is because he likes you and wants to ask you out. Huh? Would you consider going out on a date with him? I'll, I'll go, on, go a on a date. date. <laughs> with this older gentleman? Oh, no. What? 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 I like guys who are mature and reliable. Like this gentleman here. What about me? Sorry, you're not really my type. I might have given you a chance if you'd asked me out on your own, but... I like guys who've got the courage to actually ask me out. Hey, what's the big idea? This isn't how it was supposed to go at all. Why, Why am I, I the bad, bad guy? guy? <laughs> oh dear. Well, that was a very long, that was random. pointless side quest. Well, take this as a life lesson. Next time, take things into your own hands. 2,000 experience points for that. <laughs> okay. Oh dear. How many me. more side quests have we Oh wow, we've just opened a load more up. I think there were a couple that further down that were there already, but those two up the two new ones near you, I think are new. Okay, well we're near a save point here. We've done some side quests. There's probably gonna be more opening up. Let us know in the comments if you'd like us to continue with some more side quests or whether you'd like us to carry on in the main story in the next episode. But till then, see you next time. See ya.